Hey girl, what is up? Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a new video. If you are new, hello, welcome. My name is Karina, AKA OMG Lashes. Today we are talking all about underrated slash unknown makeup palettes that I personally feel need some love, some more attention. I am guilty of being such a hoarder when it comes to makeup palettes. I think that is like my number one weakness. So I have a few palettes to share with you guys here today and some of these I'm sure you know of them. Um, if not, I hope you find something new. So yeah, if you guys wanna know what those underrated slash <laughs> unknown palettes are then just keep on watching okay so the first brand that i wanted to mention i'm going to mention these as a bundle because i have three palettes from this specific brand now i know that it is common some people know of it but i don't feel like it is as hyped up as it should be and i am talking about the brand juvia's place i have the nubian 2 i have the saharan palette and i also own the Masquerade by Ju Juvius. Juvius. I did purchase these myself with my own mula, so just so you know. The very first palette that I ever bought was the Nubian 2 palettes. My freaking perro chewed on this, but girl, he didn't damage the inside, so I kept it. Me vale. Um, so this is what the first palette looks like. It is super pigmented. The intensity of these eyeshadows is so unreal. I think that it is one of the best creamiest eyeshadows that I own and that is saying a lot because I own a ton of eyeshadow palettes these are just up there with like super high quality and they're not that expensive the pan sizes on these are ridiculous there's no way that I can go through a whole palette like there's just no way the colors again super pretty I will give you guys some swatches of these so you can get an idea of what they look like but literally like look at that that is just one swipe of a swatch you get so much pigment i will have a link down below if you guys are interested in buying any of these palettes um so you can check them out okay all right moving on to palette numero dos now i know that this brand is very 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 known in the youtube world but i don't feel like this specific palette gets enough love it is the nyx ultimate shadow palettes in warm neutrals hello that says it all warm neutrals look at this palette this is a palette that i feel can be your go-to if it had a black shade in here that would be like the ideal palette because you have nice transitional shades you have some shimmer shades and then you also have your brow bone color which for me it's the ideal palettes the pigmentation on these again they're so good so pigmented and very very creamy I do have to admit that I wish these were a tiny bit more pigmented, just like a tiny bit. But the good thing about shadows that are shimmery, you can wet your brush and apply them wet. And then once they dry, they look very metallic. Metallic! I've said it before, but this palette reminds me so much of the Morphe 35O, just a smaller version of it. But it's still pretty good for the price. Now, if you guys follow me on Snapchat or if you have been watching my videos for at least the past month, you know that I recently became obsessed with these palettes. Now, I do have to say that these are very similar to Morphe, um, the Morphe palettes in general, except that these have no name. They are absolutely not branded. It's just a plain palette. I get mine from eBay. Again, I will have the links to these palettes if you want them. Um, but this is one of my favorite ones because as you can see it's super colorful perfect for the summer per Perfect for you if you are into bright Neon colorful looks. This is another gorgeous palette that contains some nice pinks purples and then some transitional colors And then this has to be my favorite palette out of the three because it is super warm Super smoky. So if you are into warm neutral colors, I think you're really going to like this one But you also have your pops of purple in here. I do have a makeup tube using this palette I will have it in a card up here somewhere. Just click on it and watch it. Okay So the next brand that I'm going to talk about is a brand that I always talk about as well and that I love a lot of the products that they have and I am talking about beauty junkies now, Beauty Junkies, if I am correct, it is sold exclusively on Amazon, but I believe they have their own website now. But again, from what I know, Amazon is where they sell 
you know, a lot of their beauty products. This is a Z palette that I have. They don't have any eyeshadow palettes. They just have Z palettes. And then you can add your own shadows and customize it. Now, these shadows were sent to me a while ago um, as a PR package, but I am not being paid to talk about them. I genuinely like them and I do use them. These eyeshadows are super creamy, very pigmented. They blend very easily onto the eyes. You really don't have to work too hard with them. And again, just pigmentation is really good as you can see by that. So if you guys are interested in any of these, I will have a link to where you can purchase the Z palettes and then the single eyeshadows if you wish to do so. Okay, so I have two last brands that I wanna speak about. Now, really quickly, I'm going to mention Coastal Sense. I think Coastal Sense is such an amazing brand um, as far as their eyeshadow palettes or their little single shadows, their hot pots is what they call them. I think they are so amazing. Now, there definitely is some hit and misses with some of their hot pots, not all of them are super pigmented. Some of them lack pigmentation. Some of them are super amazing. So I'm going to show you the ones that, I was, that I'm wearing on my eyes today. I use this one right here. This one is in the shade Bronze Peach. And it is that perfect transitional shade, which is what I used it for. I also use this one right here. It is called Volcanic Blast. Super inten intense. Super intense, like a tangerine color so pretty so much pigment to it i used it today and i was super impressed that's it these as well are from coastal sense and then the rest are from Luxie, which is a brand i will speak about in a second i also have some coastal sense eyeshadows on here as you can see some of these i've definitely hit pan because i love them again there's tons of hit and misses with the coastal sense shadows but i feel like for the price i can definitely afford to splurge on some shadows and if they don't work out i don't feel as bad wasting my money on the products but for the most part i feel like i'm pretty happy with all the shadows that i use from that brand okay and the last brand like i mentioned that i wanted to speak about was Luxie beauty again it is a brand that i stand by 110 percent i love jessica which is the owner of Luxie beauty she is such an amazing lady and uh, I just love her to pieces. So Luxie Beauty is always coming out with tons of eyeshadows and I don't know why people don't talk about this brand more often. It is such a high quality brand. Um, the products are amazing and her shadows are only $5 a piece. Now I hope you guys are ready. Hold on to your panties because your jaw is about to drop. I have so many Luxie Beauty eyeshadows that I had to get an extra extra large palette from Give Me Glow Cosmetics. This is what it looks like. This thing is ginormous. So this is what this humongous palette looks like. This palette holds 80 or 88. So it does hold a ton of eyeshadow palette or little single eyeshadows, but I think it's totally worth it. But this palette, this palette is a beast. Okay, chicas, so that is everything for today's video. These are all the brands slash palettes, whatever, that I felt I wanted to share with you guys. If you know of a brand that needs more love, definitely let me know so I can check out their page, maybe test out some products, and just keep on sharing and spreading the word. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and I'll see you chicas in my next video. Bye!